okay so we need to go in the reverse right we are doing individual reversal right now so in reverse we have this first option is what that is fb08 if you want to do yeah. individual reversal in sfps 4 hana yeah okay. so yeah. press enter so when you press enter what is our document number document one number four. is one double zero four so we yeah. want to reverse this one double zero four now then we have this company code company code is lr12 that is a fiscal year okay. fiscal year is 2020 then the reversal reason the reversal reason i'm gonna select here right now zero one zero okay. one is reversal in current period zero one right okay that yeah. is the most important thing without this reversal reason you cannot uh, reverse the voucher because that is a mandatory option okay, okay. so i'm gonna select here the reversal reason if which is zero one reversal in current period then posting date i am posting this today yeah, yeah? Now, if you are 100% sure, this 1004 is the same voucher which you want to reverse, okay, if you are 100% confirmed, then you can click this option to save, to post. But if you okay. have a doubt, if you have a doubt, you want to display this uh, entry before doing the reversal, then we have this tab, display before reversal. So if you click this display okay. before reversal, it will give us it will show you the show you the same journal entry okay right. so here we have the same if you look the bank charges that is debit and uh, posting a 50 the credit is the adcb bank that is 85000 uh the credit entry yeah yes that is our yeah. same entry so i want to reverse this voucher now so you need to go one step back and click this post okay. so when you post this one Message will come. Document number one double zero five is posted in company code LR one two. Okay. Now, if you check the report, you can click on this list at the top, and you can refresh it. If you refresh it, look at this accounting document, which is AB, right? So mm -hmm. reverse that entry. Eighty five thousand negative. The balance becomes zero again. Yeah. So this is how yeah. we can do individual reversal in SAP S4 HANA. Any question, Larry, here? No. Okay. So now our next step is that, uh, for example, we mistakenly enter this reversal. The actual amount of bank charges was 85,000, but we mistakenly entered this reversal. We mistakenly okay reverse this voucher now so our next process is that i want to reverse the reversal now okay. okay so again what is the most important information is is the voucher number is our document number which is 1005 right yeah okay so now i want to reverse this reversal so how are we going to do this the voucher number is 1005. So yeah. you need to go in this journal ledger. In journal ledger, we have this document entry. In this document entry, we have this F-02. Okay. And here we have this tab, post with reference. You need to click this post with reference. Okay. That is our document number. Document number is 1005. That is our okay. company code LR12. Fiscal year is 2020. And look at the first option in this flow control. It is generate inverse posting. So you need to click this. Yeah. You need to check this option for inverse posting, right? Yeah. And then press enter. So when you press enter, it will move to the next window. It is the same entry. You can press enter and now look again that bank charges are debited again with 85,000 and this ADCB bank yeah. is credit again. So it okay. is reversing that entry, the reverse posting, right? 
Yeah. So this is how we can enter, we can record, and we can do reverse the voucher, reverse the reversal. Okay. Right? And then save it. Yeah. So document number 1006 was posted in Company Gotes. If you check the report again, so if you look here, it, it is our reversal voucher, the balance is zero. So if we go uh, click on this list and refresh the ledger, so 85,000 is back again. So this is how we do, uh, we enter the, uh, that uh, we can do this reverse the reversal in SAP S4 HANA. Clear? Okay. Yeah, okay. Now, the next step is our mass reversal. Mass reversal is used okay. if you enter two, three vouchers consecutively wrong and you want to reverse yeah. all those vouchers, you want to reverse all of them all together. So then we're going to yeah. use this mass reversal in SAP. Okay. So let's assume okay. that yeah. we enter three vouchers wrong, 1000, 1001, and 1002. And we want to reverse all the three together. So how are we going to do that? Okay. You need to go in accounting. In accounting, we have financial accounting. In financial okay. accounting, we have journal ledger. In journal ledger, we have this document. In document, we have last folder. It is reverse. In the reverse, we have second okay. option is what f dot at for mass reversal. Okay. Enter. So here the company code is. Uh, our company code is L R one two. And uh, the document. Uh, we are, uh, assume it that uh, from 1000 oh. to 1002, the so three vouchers are wrong. 1000, 1001, and 1002. If if there uh, are, okay. if you want to give multiple selections, you can also select this option for multiple selection. Like uh, if there are like missing ranges are there. Like uh, if you want to reverse yeah. 1000, then you don't want to reverse 1001 to 1002. 1004, 1005, so you can list all of them here also. Okay. Okay, then the fiscal year, the fiscal year is 2020. Right, and uh, what is the document type yeah. here now? Tell me, what is the document type we need to enter? We are reversing a journal entry. What is the voucher type, document type? I think you still have this. It is SA. Right? Yes, I'm not, I'm not saying you spend. SA is for the journal entries. If you want to reverse the journal entries, right? Yeah. So that is SA. And uh, you can filter with the posting date files also. And look at this reversal reason here. The reversal reason is 0 1. Yes, Chris has question. Uh, sorry? Yeah, uh, zero one is the uh, that the reversal in the current period zero one. Okay, so now you need to execute this. So when you execute this, uh, it will show you that uh, these are the documents which can be reversed, right? Right now we have okay. three. So all you do, or you need to do, you need to click this tab, reverse documents. So when you click this reverse document, it will reverse all of them together. So look, number of document reverse, that is three. Okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Any question, Larry, here? No. Yeah.